Okay, so let's receive a healing message from Spirit. Okay, so the first thing I see is I'm like pretty close down to the ground and there's a snake thing and it's um, kind of turning into a millipede. <laughs> it's like a snake that turned into like this large millipede thing and it's kind of uh, constricting around this uh, fox sort of um, spirit. It's, um, it's like constricting around this fox. I mean, sorry, not a fox. I meant to say a wolf. The, and it's, it's consuming the wolf. And it's somehow laying eggs. <laughs> There's a, like a line of legs. So it's kind of converted this wolf into these um, eggs. And they're speckled, um, they have like yellow speckles on them. And now I'm seeing a really cute scene because uh, I'm like at the ocean and these eggs are hatching and the there's turtles crawling out of these eggs and they are like little children um, um, breaking out of their shells and going towards the ocean here. And now I'm seeing a, a, a wolf come back, but it's almost like this angry wolf spirit is like trying to, in the scene now, is kind of here and um, trying to like step on these turtles. So I'm going to... <laughs> I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to I'm gonna stop this from happening. So I'm going to... I'm going to... I'm gonna like, okay, what I wanna do here is I, I'm, I'm gonna take the, I wanna work with this wolf here. Um, I'm gonna take the wolf and I'm going to kind of sit him down on this bench, you know, like a timeout, like, what are you doing? Why are you stepping on these turtles? So me and the, the wolf are sitting down on this bench on the beach and we're basically letting the turtles go into the water because that's, you know, that just seems right to do so. And then I turn to the wolf and I say like, okay, well, what, do, why, why were you stepping on these um, uh, turtles here? Like, I mean, these are just children hatching out of these eggs. I mean, um, I, I know whatever happened to your wolf friend or this other version of you that got consumed, yeah, that kind of sucks, but I mean, these are turtles. These are just like children. They didn't have anything to do with it, right? So the wolf is sitting next to him on the bench and it's kind of just like, it's kind of like his head slumped down and it's just looking down. Um, and the weird thing is there's like this, <laughs> the weird thing is that like, as I'm sitting next to this wolf, um, and the, the weird thing about the wolf too is it's 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 sort of human like it's got leg it's got like human legs and like arms it's not like a real wolf it's like this anthropomorphic human type of wolf thing, guy or something the 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 head and stuff is definitely a wolf um, but anyways what I was gonna say also is there's a badger sitting on the top part of the I'm not sure if you can see this in the video but Imagine there, we're both sitting, on, I'm sitting on the bench, the wolf's right next to me, and then there's this badger, like creature, sitting by our shoulders in between us. <laughs> I, and um, I see balloons go up. I see a bunch of like birthday type of colored balloons, a lot of reds go up. Okay, so, and now what I'm inspired to do is like, okay, whoa whoa let's let's slow down here um what what are we what are we doing with all this crazy this crazy symbols right what is going on here and just one last symbol to relay here when i said that this uh centaur creature popped in symbolically here so um i felt i, I want to say i want to say that because i've never received that symbol before so that is really interesting but let's let's work with what we got here.
So let's go back and look at the story. What what happened? Um, there was a there was we started off with a snake, and then it turned into this like millipede thing that consumed this uh, wolf, and the it started laying these uh, white and yellow speckled eggs, which hatched into turtles and the turtles were running into the ocean and then this this other wolf spirit came and was like stepping on trying to step on the um turtles but i was like okay let's stop brought brought him over to the bench sat him down um so what does all this mean what is, what is all this <laughs> what is going on here i don't know and this is the funny thing about these journeys is um, these messages are could be meaning a lot of different things to different people that receive this. Um, but let's dive, let's dive in. Let's see if we can like figure out what what this could be about here. And uh, I also want to invite um, another guide to come in uh, that can help me translate this. And when I said that, I see a helicopter kind of come down. So maybe that's something of a guide or some representation there. So what could be going on here? I mean, obviously, we've got a situation where the the initial wolf was um, kind of consumed and then it got transformed into this other creatures. Um, but it seems like the wolf that's sitting next to me is upset about that. So um, so it seems like there is some type of... Um, I don't know, uh, question about this relationship, um, which is a little bit conflictive, right? I'll be honest, like, I don't know exactly where to go with this yet. I do not know. I, I feel this inspiration to just uh, to keep moving forward, actually. Because um, in doing these uh, journeys, um, part of what is, I think, gaining me awareness of this process and understanding is just to be relaying these symbols. And um, the they're kind of like dreams in which the insights kind of come by a lot of times by doing it, because by doing it, by sharing this stuff, um, the patterns start to emerge, but they're not always clear um, initially. I see a sea turtle uh, in the water, and it's got a Santa Claus hat on it, and there's a lot of lightning bolts um, around it. And it's uh, and the turtle just expanded really large. Um, it's got it's like its back is some type of it's almost like the myth of um, I remember hearing about a myth one time about a turtle that was like an island or something. It was carrying the land, and this turtle is really wide. It's like the size of an island or something. And there's something about its back that is like this almost like. The shell is almost like land in a way. Um, and I see a, a shark swimming here. And then I see a mermaid. There's a mermaid swimming around. And an image of um, this dragon-like creature, uh, orange dragon. And I'm focusing on this orange dragon. 
Um, and I'm seeing a picture of a swan interconnected with this dragon. And something, these two symbols are sort of mixing a little bit. And the swan starts breathing fire, like pl plumes, like flamethrower or fire breathing dragon types of like spraying fire all over the place. And now I see a plane. I see, um, uh, I don't know if this is accurate, but I'm just going to say it. it's like some sort of like F-14 type of fighter plane. And the fighter plane is coming right towards me and like two of them just like shoot off, shoot off around me. I kind of have an impulse to leave this journey right here. So <laughs> like... What did that all mean? I don't quite know. Uh, we're, th these journeys are so interesting um, because I'm connecting to a uh, energy world and images are just coming to me and I'm relaying them um, and I'm learning as I go. So um, this is the kind of interesting thing about these journeys is uh, the more I do them, I do start to recognize um, the symbols as almost like a type of language and uh it starts to become clear as i as i do these so here was another here was another sample of a journey and another process and um um i have to admit quite mysterious at the moment and i love that it's magically mysterious like why did this series of stuff just happen why did this come to me in this way um we don't know and i think i like saying this right now it doesn't matter we don't have to know um the the mystery of it itself is very beautiful and uh i just i wonder i wonder because i've asked for this to come through me and it's very possible that maybe one of you that are watching this some of this message is going to make perfect sense for somewhere in your life and that's I have no idea what it was about because it was meant for maybe you or you, you know? So, <laughs> yeah, I, I'm just going to leave it here. And uh, this was another interesting uh, journey. And I thank you for the guides that came through. And, uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. And um, I would love your feedback. Share what you thought or maybe this connected you in some way. Like, let me know. I'd be really curious. Okay, thank you guys.